Ladies and gentlemen, we are back with Legends TV, and this is more than just a TV show today. This is more than just a tribute to Mr. Frank Prince. This is a community, a community of artists, singers, wrestlers, comics, TV hosts, a true community, and we want everybody to come out and support the Mousetrap Cafe opening this Thursday and support live arts on Long Island. And the co-owner, the co-owner of Madhouse TV and the Mousetrap Cafe, Mr. Tommy Marr is about to perform. Tommy is as great a vocalist as you are ever going to hear. I am jaded. I have heard the best of the best. Going back to Al Green, James Brown, Marvin Gaye, Smokey Robinson, seen them all live, and I love Tommy's music. I love Tommy's voice. Without further ado, Mr. Tommy Ma. Well, thank you, Evan, for putting an extreme amount of pressure on me. But um, first off, I, was, I just want to talk about my friend, um, Frank Prince. Um, Frank, he always called me his big brother. I think I was the guy that he, you know, when he needed a guy to talk to, he would call me. He'd call me three times a week. We talked for a lot of time. He just asked for a lot of advice and stuff. And, you know, the guy was just that great guy that deserved so much more. Than, than he ever really got to show us. And um, I gotta tell you, I, I had so many sit downs with him and we've talked about everything and I know all the things he loved in the world and I know the, all the things he didn't love in the world. And uh, there was one thing that he always was curious about was, which was Woodstock. And being that I was at the 1969 Woodstock, he would always ask me constantly, constantly, constantly to talk about it. what was it like, what was it like, you know. And finally, I just said, Frank, you know, you, you know I do the gig up there at Yazga's Farm every year. Why don't you come up with us? So for the past three years, Frank has come up. And I think it's the happiest I've ever seen Fra Frank Prince in my life, and I truly mean that. The guy was dancing around the forest. He had friends all around him. It was just a beautiful thing to actually see him have such happiness before he passed. Because, um, I mean, I loved him like a, like a little brother, you know? And... Uh, I, I don't want to lose it up here, but I got to tell you, he will be sorely, sorely missed. He was a great, great, great friend and a great man that gave everything he had to give. And uh, last night, you know, Janine and I were talking, and I'm like, I, I really don't know what kind of songs I could do to do him justice. And actually, 5 o'clock this morning, I woke up, and I still didn't have any songs. And I said, you know, I remembered a, a conversation that we had, and it was a, a, a racial conversation about, you know, uh, in the 60s and that. And... Um, he, he said, I said, the best really way to explain it was there's two songs out there. Change Gonna Come and uh, Brother, Brother, Brother. And uh, they were two songs that he, I turned them on to and he loved the songs. I've never performed this song. I don't really know it and I really don't want to mess it up. But for Frank Prince, I'm going to give this, this song a chance. And uh, please bear with me if I don't do it right, but believe me, my heart and my soul's in there. If it comes out wrong, it's, it still means from here. So Frank, this is for you, brother. Movie and 
Somebody keep telling me Don't hang around It's been a long Long time coming But I know Change gonna come Oh yes it will Then I go to my brother And I say Brother, help me please. But he winds up knocking me back down on my knees. Lord, there's been times, there's been times I thought it wouldn't last for long. But now I think, I think I know I'll be able to carry on. Well, it's been a long Long time coming, yeah. But I know he's up there looking down on all us. It's been a long, a long time coming, but I know change gonna come. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, yes, it is. As for you, brother, rest in peace. Thank you.